All right, what up guys? Today I got a CRKT and I cannot say the name. O-B-A-K-E. It's a Burnley design. It's kind of like a like a traditional katana knife, like a miniature version. I'm sure there's a special name for like the miniature versions of them. I think there is, but <clears throat> I'm not too familiar with it. And uh, this is a knife I originally looked at and was like, eh, I'll never, I'll never want to buy that, you know? It's just not my, my cup of tea. But I recently watched a video and I can't remember the name. It's the name of a website and these guys make videos. Um, I cannot remember the name. It's killing me, but whatever. <clears throat> um, and uh, what, what, what caught my eye is how they carry the sheath on this and it's a fixed blade and if you all know fixed blades are pretty much generally pretty hard to carry um, you, you usually carry them on the outside of your belt with a tech lot either dangler drop leg whatever um, they're hard to conceal everybody sees it they get caught on stuff a folder is just generally eas easier especially at work to carry just around town and st stuff without catch people catching their eyes or, or everything in general. And uh, so it, it is hard to carry a fixed blade. I've been looking at the Oxford, what is that? I can't think of that name either. I am cannot think of anything right now. But anyway, and then I saw this on how he uh, carries it. And um, what they do is they loop, loop, Pretend my two fingers here is uh, the belt. And then you would run the sheath through there like that. So that would be on your belt like that. I don't know if you can see it. But yeah, it's all black and everything in the background is black. But but yeah. Anyway, you'd loop it around, you know, around itself. And then this would be your waist behind here. And you'd sit it like about like that down in your waistband you know tucked inside and then you would carry the knife in there like that and that just caught my eye it seemed like it was really efficient way to carry it's not on the outside of your belt it's not catching on anything and when you need it you just you know take it out pull and then you got like kind of like a dangle and then you can use the knife and then you just grab the sheath with your other hand put the knife back in and then tuck it behind your waist belt, waist line or belt or whatever you want to call it. And uh, it, it, I've been carrying it for a few days now, and it's been pretty efficient, efficient way to carry a fixed blade. I've never, I've tried carrying fixed blades. You know, you got your neck knives. It's just unpractical because you, to conceal them, you tuck them in in behind your shirt. Then you got to pull them out of your neck. You look like a crazy person. Um, this just seems more efficient. You know. And uh, it's it's working pretty well. I'm really surprised. And not only that, the knife itself is is what was surprising. Uh, the handle wrap I thought was going to be you know those loose paracord wrapped handle knives that kind of float around and usually work their way loose. This stuff I don't know if they dip it in some kind of resin or epoxy or some kind of like Elmer's glue, <laughs> but uh, it's hard as it's hard as a rock. We didn't go nowhere. And uh, actually the retention on the sheath, as you can see, has a little um, divot in the top part here. And the, the, the paracord is actually what goes on that divot. And you can hear it. That sound is coming from the string. So it's, it sound, you know, the sound is hard enough. The string is hard enough to make a sound. If, if, if that's not crazy enough and it has a nice retention and snap it's crazy the sheath no jiggle no nothing um, it's just crazy I, I, I would have never thought in a million years I'd like this knife but I, I really like this knife <laughs> I like most knives from CRKT though and uh, it's easy to conceal, seal easy to carry and I think it also came with a belt mount, which I haven't played with yet, actually. I guess you could carry a scout carry, which I might actually try that, too. That's crazy. 
Um, scout carry, I don't know. You couldn't carry it like that. You could put it, oh, you could put it there as well, higher up. I don't think you can carry it, um, you know, horizontal. There's no way to mount it that way. So pretty much scout carry is, is your only option. But I do that belt thing, and uh, it works quite well. But uh, this knife, it's just crazy. It's just crazy. I would have never thought in a million years I'd like this. And it's got some kind of wrap underneath. It's like a traditional katana wrap on it. And it's crazy. But anyways, that's it for this one. I know I'm kind of jittery and da 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 Today is my Friday, so hopefully I'll get some relax. Probably not. I got a bunch of bills to pay, and you know how money goes. And uh, anyway, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And peace out.